and we certainly are glad that the hemp car is here at the Knox County Fair. We invite you, it's only going to be here today, so I would suggest you get here to the Knox County Fair and look over the hemp car, find out all about this alternative uh, to our fuel of motoring around the United States. Now, you're involved in the, the fuel end of this, is that right? Correct. Uh, Apple Energy is dedicated to the construction of micro biodiesel facilities. 500,000 gallons production a year in regional communities as opposed to macro construction, which would be multi-million gallon a year facilities where you have to truck your grain the five hours drive. We believe in wherever the grain is grown, the fuel should be manufactured there. And we need alternative uh, fuels and we need to find ways to uh, to be able to fuel our vehicles without something other than oil products. Correct. It's, uh, the beauty of biodiesel is you can use any oil seed crop, ranging from castor bean to palm oil uh, to soy oil to hemp oil, and uh, create a fuel that is 90% cleaner, 90% less carcinogenic than standard diesel fuel. Same energy and 90% cleaner. What kind of mileage are they getting on the hemp car? Uh, pre Introduction of biodiesel, they were getting 27 miles per gallon. Post introduction of biodiesel, 27 miles per gallon. Okay, so pretty much, uh, pretty much there. Across okay, the board. are they traveling all over uh, the United States with the hemp car? Correct. It's a 10,000 mile journey on the map, uh, starting from Virginia, D.C., it's, uh, to uh, Montreal, Canada, to Toronto, Detroit, down to Columbus, back up to Winnipeg, Canada, over to Vancouver, down to Seattle down to San Diego, over to Austin, Texas, Atlanta, Georgia, Charlotte, North Carolina, and back up to D.C.